We are currently in downtown Guadalajara. Guadalajara is a very interesting city because it is known as the Silicon Valley of Mexico. However, it still has this historic downtown area where it almost feels like you've gone back in time. We just finished up a walking tour of downtown Guadalajara. We saw a lot of cool historic buildings, all the churches and the squares, and the whole area is beautiful with all the trees. Everything is blooming right now. It's a really, really cool downtown area, and we really enjoyed the walking tour. So everyone has been telling us we have to go try tortas ahogadas. Uh, it's a local popular uh, dish we haven't tried yet. So we're gonna go to the largest market in Latin America and see if we can find some. in the largest indoor market in Latin America. It has three floors and it has this nice courtyard in the center and we've been told that you can find everything here. If you can't find it here, then it probably doesn't exist. We had a really good day exploring Guadalajara. We ended up walking about 16 kilometers all day. So we are all pretty tired and you can park overnight here in this lot and it's only 187 pesos. So we are just gonna camp in the parking lot tonight. Hey Finley, did you have a good day bud? He is white. We drove a little further south to a town called Tonala. We are going to go check out a massive flea market and on the way the walking path has all these really beautiful clay uh, statues with lots of placards that tells you all about them. Very pretty. Get snacks. What is it? It's like a chocolate pancake. What'd you get? I don't know. Cream with coconut, I think. Hi, Finley. How are you doing, bud? Are you enjoying the market? Yeah. So we just got back from the Tanola Street Market. It was absolutely massive. They had everything you can think of there and it all seemed to be reasonably priced. It was also kind of chaotic getting around, but it was a lot of fun. We picked up a couple of fun things. We got some fun hand towels for the van. We got four for a hundred pesos, which is about $7. And we got this super cute Mexican doll for my niece. Bye. Bye.
and our Max Air fan is making a really weird squeaky noise so we think it's a little bit too dirty so we're going to take it apart, clean it and put it back together. Good morning, welcome to Tlakipaki. We arrived here last night and ended up just parking on the street just outside of town, which isn't ideal. However, it does put us in a great spot to be able to come in early, snack parking, and then go explore. So we're in Pueblo Mexico, just south of Guadalajara. It's essentially still part of the urban area, so it's super cool to have such an interesting area right by the city. The main downtown area is so pretty. All of the stores are filled with very elaborate arts and crafts and handmade goods and coffee shops and whatnot. And they all seem to be in old, beautiful mansions. Every single store is absolutely beautiful. We're in the town hall building right now and we always find that there's always a huge elaborate mural that depicts the history of the area and they're always beautiful. Like there's one right here. Finley can't go in the museum so we're taking turns walking through it. Town Square is filled with restaurants and at about 3.30 mariachi bands come and play. So we're gonna head to the Old Town Square, grab a snack and listen to some mariachi. So it turns out at El Perian for mariachi for the one hour, each table has a minimum spend of 50-ish dollars a person and we don't want to see mariachi that badly so we're just gonna walk around, enjoy the fair and get some street food. <laughs> there you go, Finley. <laughs> so we got some tuba, which is made from palm tree sap, and then it's got peanuts on top, and it's really refreshing. Trucks are going so fast. Yeah. And to do that fast, they're running two stop signs. I know. Oh. Crazy drivers here. Good to tour. Good morning. We are back downtown. It is Sunday in Guadalajara, which is when they shut down a lot of the main streets and it becomes a bike and pedestrian area. So we're gonna go exploring, 
we're gonna do a free bike tour and then we're gonna keep walking around downtown. Got your bike. Got our bike, got our high vis vest. Now we're gonna go for a tour. We're all done the biking tour. It was a lot of fun cycling around and seeing all the historic buildings. The tour was in Spanish, so thankfully we did a walking tour a couple days ago, which was in English. So we could use that knowledge and work on our Spanish. We're just heading back to the van now. We're gonna go get Finley and then we'll take him back out and do some more walking around and exploring. Hello. We missed you. We're getting you. a lot of current, but we're pulling a lot of current. <laughs> 